Hey everyone, my name is Tact, and I am the creator of Bevel's Food Fight. Food Fight has just hit 2 million plays, and with that milestone, we're launching the biggest update Food Fight has ever had. First, I just want to say thank you for the 2 million plays on this map. It's absolutely my biggest achievement of all time as a creator so far, and I really appreciate the love and support from this community. So, what's new in the update? Let's find out. Previously, in the mid and end game, metal generators were useless islands that nobody visited often due to everybody having upgrades already and Flintnox being in presence. In the 2 million update, we're adding a new mechanic to metal islands to make them more important through the entire round, and this new mechanic are the weapon manager stations. Interacting with a weapon manager will allow you to change the variant of the weapon class you're currently using. For example, a lever action shotgun would turn into a striker pump shotgun. Use these weapon managers to help build your loadout. These weapon managers are inspired by their use in SCP Secret Laboratory. We've done a lot of general balancing on the game since the Mythic update. We've adjusted the pricing of many items such as the Chiller Grenade and the Med Mist to better compensate their use and availability. Not only this, but we've also removed Sky's Grappler from the Mythic vending machines on the Gold Island and removed Jules Glider Gun from Uber Presence. Previously, Jules' glider gun remained on top, and no item in the game could compete with it. Moreover, the item was easy to obtain from Ubers, and it dominated the game. We needed to nerf the availability of the item, and it's now exclusive to the Mythic Fending Machines at the Gold Island at a new price of 60 gold. Every update, we introduce something new to the game to keep the meta fresh, and in this update, we are introducing shield kegs, armored walls, the double barrel shotgun, the boom bow, and more to the loot pool. I'm excited to see how the new items are used, and how balanced we've made them. I am quite scared for how skilled players are going to be using the boom bow. Furthermore, there is even more hidden content within Food Fight's new update. We've made secret changes to the gold island, adding a new secret fifth area to the map. I wonder who will be the first to find it. We've also updated the map theme to allow the time of day to cycle between day and night and to let the party run wild. And about Accolade XP, we've added the ability for weapon managers, core item, and mythic vending machines to grant XP once it recalibrates. Finally, I just want to give out a shout out to the player named Hornet Quartz. This player has over 2,000 eliminations in Bebel's Food Fight, and Personally, I believe that is the biggest number of eliminations any player has ever had on this game. You are absolutely in first place on our leaderboard. Congratulations, great job, and thank you for playing. Thank you for watching this uh, video, and thank you for playing Bedwolves Fruit Fight. We will see you in-game.